Tonight, Silicon Valley business leaders are reacting to the latest masking changes. Leaders say they're working on a plan to continue doing business while also trying to keep its workers safe. Crown Force Dan Thorne, live tonight in the newsroom with this part of the story. Dan, what are they saying? Well, Jonathan, business leaders were happy to have people no longer wearing masks indoors, but they also understand that at this time it's a smart move. But their biggest concern for business owners and their employees as this Delta variant continues to increase infections is making sure they will continue to stay open. Increasing COVID-19 infections are forcing Silicon Valley businesses, along with others across the Bay Area, to return to mask wearing indoors. Business leaders want to keep their customers happy, but also safe. If we need to put masks on to stay safe and to keep business flowing and customers coming in through the door, then that's what we need to do. Silicon Valley Central Chamber President Christian Malsek says he understands that after a year and a half, people are tired of having to wear masks. He's also a little worried about customers who do not want to follow the reinstated mandate. But the biggest concern for businesses is if the increasing infections will force closures. Even if lockdowns were never around the corner, it's the uncertainty that makes uh, businesses very scared. And that keeps them from investing that keeps them from doing things that they might have done if they thought that the pandemic was truly behind us and we were moving on. Malsack is hoping people do not get discouraged by the health mandates. He says business owners and employees are counting on people to continue to support them. And the health officials are not telling us to stay home. We need to recover. And you coming through our doors is, is a big piece of that. Plus, we want to see you again. The increase in case rates have also forced some of the biggest employers in Silicon Valley to postpone reopening or putting in place vaccine mandates for workers who go into the office. Those businesses include Apple, Google, and Facebook. Reporting live in the newsroom, Dan Thorne, Cron4 News.